the first quarter of the year, the quarter through March. These were relatively small positions for Appaloosa, but broadly speaking, an interesting play nonetheless. Uh, also during the quarter, pairing back Kohl's by 58%, Macy's by 22%, and Nordstrom by 18%. But on the flip side, during the quarter, they actually upped e-commerce, the largest e-commerce company uh, in the world, Amazon, up by 21% to hold $277 million at quarter and largest e-commerce company, at least here in the U.S. Um, now, keep in mind, these are positions are as of the end of March. They may have changed in the six weeks since then. But again, kind of an about face on some of these retailers, mall names that we mentioned last quarter. Yeah, and I mean, as you know, as, as well as I do, he, he's among the most nimble uh, that, that have ever lived. I mean, in terms of making, mm -hmm. if this is from the end of March, so much has changed since the end of March. The, the markets have gotten much more turbulent. You know, he, he's the one, again, who, who told me that he thought the Fed had a little bit of a credibility problem. So it was obvious that he had taken a more cautious stance on what the overall environment looked like. And even though, you know, as Kramer said the other day, as Tepper told him that he had covered his Nasdaq short and stressed for a trade, um, you have to believe that his view of the world at this very moment, less is more cautious than it's been in, in quite some time. Yeah, if this is any reflection of his view on the consumer, it's that they may not be back out shopping in the way that perhaps he expected to at the end of the year. Again, these were small positions, but you did have kind of a scattering of these small names that you don't typically see in some of the big 13Fs, or at least you haven't in recent years, as they've opted maybe for some big tech names or some high growth stocks, some recent IPOs, names like that. So to see these names pop up in an Appaloosa filing was newsworthy, got some headlines. Uh, this quarter, though, seems like it's perhaps less of a of a big play for the firm. Yeah, when Tepper sneezes about the market, it gets headlines, and for obvious reasons. Leslie, thank you <laughs> uh, very much. That's Leslie Picker. I know we'll see you again soon, because we expect these to come out um, anytime during this hour, and we'll certainly bring them to you. For now, let's get to our Twitter question of the